During our 14 years in Nashville, we would look at one another from time to time and wonder out loud if God would ever call us back to Canada. A turning point for me was a birthday trip I took to Ontario. I visited the cemetery where my parents are buried and wondered if we were to live out our lives in Tennessee or if perhaps God had something else for us. Then a couple of months later, I attended our annual pastor's retreat, and I was asked if I would consider moving to Toronto to be a part of our church plant there. So I came home and told Sheila about it. My initial response was no, not because I don't love Toronto, but the obstacles just seemed overwhelming. Not only that, but life in Tennessee has been good to us. But we couldn't shake it. So finally, we prayed and fasted about it, and the answer became clear. It was time, it was time to follow the call. Toronto has 5.6 million people. It's the fifth largest metropolitan area in all of North America. A lot of people don't realize how big it is. You know, they hear about it, they hear about Toronto Blue Jays, Raptors, Toronto Maple Leafs, they know it has major pro sports teams. They don't really realize, you know, the magnitude of the city or the impact that it has. The cities of the world are changing. For the first time in human history, more than half of the world's population lives in cities, and this trend is accelerating. A hundred thousand people a year move into Toronto. Toronto is diverse. In fact, there are more people from other nations than were born in Canada, making it the most ethnically diverse city in the world. Toronto is a major educational, cultural, and business hub with 5.6 million people, making it the fifth largest metropolitan area in North America. Our call is to the heart of the city. We've secured at the University of Toronto for Sunday mornings a beautiful, state-of-the-art film review theater. Our vision is to be a multi-ethnic church of students and urban professionals who love God and are catalysts for city, national, and global transformation. Who do you want to tell everybody about? Jesus! Uh, Jesus, he did! He wanted to tell everybody about Jesus. When we moved to Nashville, we felt like it would be a season of training for us, and then we would take what we learned back to Canada with us. But that vision was long forgotten until now. Now is the time, and we have decided to follow the call. Something's happening in the world right now, and it requires a unique response from all of God's people. For us, it means leaving a place we love and venturing out into what God has for us next. So our encouragement is that you would ask Him what it is that He would have you to do. And whatever it is, follow the call.